moving dead of a menifus. In 1893, as archaeologist Howard Carter triumphantly sails down the Nile, carrying 42 sarcophagi of Egyptian pharaohs, having gone seen for over 1,200 years, thousands circulate on the banks. Children, parents, grave diggers all weep. In their tears the prayer it might all come to some good end. With my hands upon this wheel, the motor churning water, behind my back and beneath the boat, I hear the pulsing rhythms of fists on chests, and the shaking throats gripped tight, letting sail the songs of sorrow. Not unusual for these waters, heart sprung tears, rain, the water shed and lost, from which this land has grown. Tomorrow I carry grain. Father, Father, as my sandaled feet shake upon this heated sand, why can we not dance to joyous song? I cannot stop the tears. They are squeezed from out of my eyes. Hold me, Father. Leave me from this sadness. The tears you shed so pierce my heart, I cannot drink of them, but only share within their flow. It is the current that moves that sailing ship. Father, do not leave my hands to raise and cross them upon your chest. My son, my child, my children, hold tight my legs and walk away to cry. Release. How might I speak the words that teach or even tell of leaving to lose and to be lost? It is drifting forward. My child, my father, hold tight the fists against your crying eyes in joy, so that we might one day draw them forth and share our wedded palms upon our cheeks in a kiss and warm embrace. When you have returned from leaving and we lay together with earth and life from which I extend my hands muddled and moistened from having brushed away the dirt and dust, now with dropping of discovered waters, my father my son. Mother, daughter, to you passing there I let my throat and lungs ring, resound for you, 
that you might catch my breath, I fill your sails, so that you might return to stern and there in joy stand to look down with love upon me. I wish not that you were before my feet, for though I see your hollow eyes I feel, my parents, that you are not in the grandest land of Pharaoh's dreams. Boatman, Captain, do not take our fathers from their home with and in us. Do not wrench them from our arms. I release you to sail downstream as I flow through your waters and my child mine. My tears wash the dirt from my palms, now clean but gone. To see their living eyes would I not have parted earth as the waters rock the deck beneath my feet and I hear them rattle in the hold to hold their hands and bleed ours not in the rending of such discovery I too am drawn downstream but in this moment I feel your hands and I share my tears with the peoples of your land that you may give such joyous recovery, birth. All upon the shore I weep with you and wish it were not so, but this is not waters, how waters flow in joy and loss to have your kingly love my cargo my cargo forgive us this moving joy as we now journey from mausoleum to museum having scraped away the dirt and mystery beneath which you were so buried, sarcophagus. Now such priceless, so, so very priceless, dried and aged buried flesh. My love, I leave you with the tickle trickling tears of our children upon your face. They cry with us. My love, our parting, we have been so long together. And as I am from with you so now given I leave our children against your warm and fertile earthly breast children I raise my arms to you in soft farewell from this clothing darkness do not cry and wail such mournful songs of sorrow. For we are together now and in the brief sight of our eyes again I will sleep joyously above the earth. Though you shall again not stand beside me as you did the day I was unearthed. Goodbye, my love. 
as they float, flow down my breast, the waters of your journey shall be smooth to another resting place. You are so moved. And in the river carried no longer in but to on me until even you return to dust. We shall hold again long divided from such wrappings as if pre-birth. Return to dirt and dust. Ye shall be from such swaddling clothes as flesh. In that day, our children, we shall not be moved to tears. For they will be Pharaohs for whom the children upon the land sang. Goodbye, my love. I kiss you and we fade away as the flowing hearts join all we children in the joyous growing that is the passing of the days. I love eternity and so to eternity we shall return forever again.